This is amazing. Yes. Well, I know what I'm doing today. I'm not done here. I'm at a recreational site, but we have it's real heavily worked. Found this oxidation layer. Nice rust in there. So I'm gonna take this red layer, which I've been reading all about, and see how much gold's in it. There were two flakes. Two little nice pieces of wire looking flakes. So there's definitely gold in it. But I want more gold than that, so let's keep looking. I just was looking over here and I saw this screwdriver. So someone was digging for gold. Probably right there. So I'm gonna get out the metal detector next. So there's gold here. Absolutely gold here. So let's just see if we can find a tiny little nugget. But oh, there's some nice crevices over here. But this is a heavily worked area. There's been a lot of activity. Uh, these crevices have all been worked right in here. Um, see how loose that material is. So somebody's been in there. Heck, here's somebody's jug of water. So I'll look around, move some stuff and see if I can't find an unworked crevice. But the only good thing about all these worked crevices means that there must have been good enough gold that whoever keeps working them keeps coming back. So if I can move something that somebody else wasn't able to then i might find a nice little pocket of gold from the looks of all these worked crevices actually i'd be damn near short of it because these were all worked we're gonna figure this out guys this is a massive core sample i mean nothing else makes a circular plunge like that Well, I'm in the gold re I'm definitely where gold has been found. Maybe all the gold is gone, but I'm gonna bust out the gold monster 1000. See if we can get any hits in this here region. Maybe in that shit where people might not be as off to detect. I'm gonna try to use my knowledge and see if I can't find me a nugget. But this region's heavily, heavily traveled. There's been a lot of holes dug, a lot of crevices creviced. I mean, even right there, that's been creviced. We got the gold master. We got this brush. I'm gonna unplug it so you guys can hear what I'm hearing and see what I'm seeing. That thing's screaming gold. However, I can already see it. I didn't even see it at first, but there's a piece of aluminum can, Budweiser. So, still a small target, but that was my screamer, so. We'll keep going. All right, guys, well, we got this shovel full. Let's see what it is. And then there's more in the, the hole, so I don't know. I should be doing this differently. If I find a piece of gold, guys, it'll be my first ever. All right, 
I need, I wish I had a better way to record this. Okay. What is going on? Alrighty guys, so let me uh, try to figure this out and I'll come. I feel like an idiot. So this has a probe in the back. I'm gonna keep here in the probe. So here's target number two. I'm just not sure. So we're gonna dig it. I should have brought my pin pointer. It's in the truck. But we're digging it. We're gonna see, and this is nice, more compacted gravels. Uh, we'll see what happens. it is in the pan let's see all right i'm gonna go ahead and well what the hell right there it is that's an old lead sinker a lead sinker well that's good though that means i'm in the right area if there's a lead sinker that means lead dropped out here meaning gold dropped out here and there was a guy already dug this hole we're gonna pan where this guy was at in his hole and see what he had going on we're gonna pan that dirt that i just um i just found that lead sinker and see if we got any gold in there i almost dumped it but right there it is that's a nice chunky piece too. Another piece up in the top corner. That's a nice little flake of gold. I almost dumped it. I said, let me just double check. I'm definitely sucking that one up. With that, I'm gonna, I'm gonna grab another pan full. I like that flake of gold we got out of that. I'm gonna go for one more pan, see what's happening. Don't look yet, but I just panned the second layer. Let's, let's see if we can do this together. There's fan in back. Our heavies, or our lighters than our heavies. See if we can spot some gold up there. I have a good feeling there will be gold in this pan. Since we're pretty deep. And there's gold in the last pan. Trying to get this done fast for you. But, oh yeah, oh yeah, look at that, boys. <laughs> okay, hold on, hold on. See that? And two up, two specks right there. There's another speck right there. So, that's a little bit coarser yet. That's a nice speck of gold. We'll suck them ones up and keep on panning. There's more gold there. So there's the hole. I'm just working the edge of it right there, them root systems, and there's gold coming out of the roots. I'm gonna keep working it. Yo, I don't even gotta zoom in. Them pieces is arguably, I think my metal detector actually sees them because when I when I picked this pan up, it, it, it rang gold. Come on, damn it. All right, so let's see if that, I believe this detector can see that tiny little flake. I think it does. Oh. Guys, that is a small little, I don't think it's even called picker yet, but 
turn this puppy on. Look at this. So if you can see right there, that red layer, it's not red there, it's not red there, it's red right there. And it's red right down in here. And it's red right there. That's where most of this gold's coming from, is these little red, red pockets. And this is all red. So I'm gonna just keep digging. Right here, I've been chopping away at this. It's real oxidized, green looking stuff and i'm getting a i'm getting a tone here like a, it's, it's registering gold and iron right in here so i'm trying to dig that tone out until i get that out and that's actually what i've been chasing this whole time but every pan has gold so we're just panning away yes i found a freaking picker look at the size of that one. <laughs> oh, oh, that's awesome I heard that on my metal detector. <laughs> yes! Guys, this is amazing. Yes! Well, I know what I'm doing today. I'm not done here. I found the nugget there. We got this massive boulder. Let's see if I can... Show you guys. Oh, ho, 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 ho. So we're gonna see what's under here. See what the metal detector says and see if uh see if we can't pull up a nugget. Another one. <laughs> That's a really cool thing to say. Another one. <sighs> All right. So this guy, I just found him in my hole. Alive. There's no water over here, buddy. We're in the wrong spot. I'm going to put you back in some water. So I think you're covered. You were... Were you guarding the gold, bud? I just heard two gunshots over there. So it is hunting season. But we got my boulder up. And we got that same rich red layer right there. So I'm going to pull this material. And then the bottom of this hole and see if, if there's any good gold in here. The metal detector can't decide. But... I think there might be some gold down in here. I'm gonna check that. There's the pan out of the hole. And whatever it is that the metal detector couldn't decide is in there. So, let's go pan it. This will probably be the last pan that I'm gonna record today. And then we'll give you a total update on all the gold. I'm gonna get back to the camera. But, um, so I'm gonna go ahead and pan this out for you and then I'll, I'll come back when we're at the end of the pan and show you what's in there. Guys, I actually didn't find anything in that last pan from the bottom below the, um, there might be some mica, a bunch of black sand, but I didn't find anything below the, uh, below the rocks. So I'm gonna keep going into the, the sidewall there. Well, I had a lot of fun today. So here's a picture of the gold all cleaned up and uh, we don't have a scale until Tuesday where we'll measure it up. Then we will put a post on the channel there. So go ahead, follow along, subscribe, hit that bell icon and uh, thanks so much.